Hi everyone. Today I am actually wiring all the servos and the potentiometers um, all the way down the, the the middle, so I can have just one bunch of wires that are going to go all the way to the control area. And I only have one more servo in one more potentiometer and I was uh, gonna I was gonna finish without making a video because honestly anybody can make a wire but then I, f I remember I have problems with a potentiometer a few days ago <laughs> so um, I'm not gonna assume that everybody knows how to do these things so um I um, I cut this servo um i cut the end and what i'm going to do is um i'm going to take this long wire it's about six feet long um the reason it is six feet long is because this is the lowest part of the robot and i'm going to go up his whole leg and maybe even his um vertebrate and the control panel is going to be inside the chest. Uh, it's gonna be accessed through the back. That is the, that's what I think. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you what I did on how to put this wire inside there. Um, the first thing I did was split this wire into, into three independent wires and I, I would say about an inch and a, and a half long. Um, then I'm going to take and remove a small portion of the wire cover. Uh, this is like one eighth of an inch. I don't know in centimeters or millimeters, guys, I'm sorry. Um, then I am placing the wire inside the soldering paste and I am going to up solder, solder a small amount of wire or solder to each wire. All right, that's the first part. So I know that all the branch won't come apart. That's why I did it first. All right, now next, I'm going to take some of this uh, heat sink uh, shrinking uh, covers. This is like one eighth of an inch and I'm going to cut three small pieces. Then I'm going to take um, a bigger piece, a bigger amount, amount, uh, if I can find it. It was here a few minutes ago. And this one is about a quarter of an inch. I'm gonna take about two inches of that. <clears throat> so what I'm gonna do first is take the two inch, place it inside and I'm going to take the small pieces alrighty now I'm going to take the servo 
I'm going to split into three again. I would say it about three quarter of an inch to half inch. This one doesn't have to be long at all. Again, go ahead and remove a little bit of the cover. Dip it in the soldering paste. And apply, apply some soldering so your brands don't come loose. Now take each one and weld it to the same colors, brown to brown, red to red, orange to orange. I should put some music while I'm doing it, right? Because I'm not fast. So, so people don't get bored. I should put some music. Not happening. I'm not. I know so some of you out there are really good at soldering are looking at this video and saying oh my god Fernando but I'm sorry I keep saying I don't like soldering So now they are wired together. And what I'm going to do next is um, place the small shrink tubing over each one of those sol soldering pieces that I have just made. And I'm taking my soldering iron and just heating it up so they shrink. And after those three are done, let me zoom in. Now the previous thing. Now apply the big one on top of those three. Um, I did this like six times, seven times. I did not have any problem and I did them fast, but of course I am now making a video and why not look like a fool doing it?
Now, if you guys, if one of you have a better solution to these things, please post it so I can learn. Remember, I am a sign maker. I am not a electronic whiz. I'm not a rob electromechanic engineer, robotic nerd. All right, I am, I am. Incredible. This is gonna eat me and make my video longer. I'm going to have to edit it and remove some some of these bad parts to make myself look better, probably. This is awful, people. I am going to take a longer, a thicker piece, piece. much better faster easier start with the right size i guess is the best way to do it and again um i could i could use a heat gun for this All right, so now I have this six feet long. I am going to insert it into the, through this hole all the way to the top. Now, the way I am doing it is I have a small um, metal wire or small metal rod. And what I'm doing is I am inserting that rod first I probably probably not gonna have access to, to to put more wires through here so I might make another wire a little higher up um, now I bend the the end into a u-shape and what I'm doing is inserting the wire. And inserting it in. has come out on the top I don't need this wire anymore now I can pull it and there we go and um, what I'm doing to hold those wires in place is just taking a rubber band. I placed the whole robot leg down and I insert a rubber band. To hold that in place. As you can see 
Now, I'm going to do the same thing again, but I am going to solder one of these pots. Because I don't have to cut wires, basically I just have to solder the end of the wires here and put it through the, through all the way up and then insert this into the into the um, casing of the old servos um, I'm not going to show you this because it is the same process that I just did it's just that I don't have to split wire I just have to put the wire right here and then insert it this is my last wire and then I can start um, testing some of the servos on the on the potentiometers to make sure it's okay I believe I also have to wire some motors that are loose yet and then um, put those two toes back I made on a new revision um, to make sure that the the the, thing, the toe goes up um, in the previous videos he, it was going down to normal, but they were not going up. And I needed to go up because um, when the foot steps, um, the toes have to go up. So that will be another video that I will make. Hopefully um, this helps. Um, talk to you later. Remember to subscribe to, to see the whole progress of this invention come up together. And some of the files are in Thingiverse. I haven't posted any of the newest files because this is a trial and error. Um, some things will break. Sometimes parts will not um, be good enough and I have to redesign them. So when I'm happy with the whole thing, then I'll start sharing. All right. Talk to you soon.